This is Jeff Scott Soto, and I'm wide awake in my dreamland. So Frontiers came to me reminding me that it's time for uh, another solo album, and this actually makes solo album number seven. If you include all the live stuff and the Essentials Ballads, that's 12 releases in the past 18 years. As we're going into the two decade mark with Frontiers Records, they wanted me to partner up with my dear friend, Alessandro Del Vecchio, who's pretty much uh, proven himself as a house writer, producer, uh, musician, songwriter, I mean, you name it. The guy is uh, the jack of all trades and master of all. As a producer, I wanted to, sh to showcase everything I love from JSS. I wanted to showcase everything for Jeff to be Jeff, but elevated. So Alessandro produced the entire record. He wrote all the songs. He actually played on all the songs. Uh, he sent me the original demos and he's playing everything. I wrote all the lyrics to all the melody ideas on the road and I literally came off a two month tour with maybe three days off and I dove straight into recording the vocals of this album here in my home studio. My buddy August Zadro plays guitar and sings for Dennis DeYoung. I called him in and said, man, please, I need that piercing siren high voice of yours uh, to finish up these harmonies. I was able to bring him in for uh, a song between the lines as well as uh, the solo. I have my longtime partner in crime, the best drummer I've ever worked with, the, the, the person who thinks the way I do. If I could play the drums, I would play them exactly like this guy, uh, Edu Cominato. He joined the JSS band in 2009, and we've been together ever since. He's played on every record, uh, whether it's been the band Soto or my solo records, he's done every record, and he'll continue to do so as long as he's interested. Ale told me, I got this guy, Fabrizio Scattoni. Fabrizio Scattoni. On guitar, my mind was completely blown away. I, as much as Ale told me, this guy was amazing. This guy was everything I dreamed of on these songs. He was everything I could have imagined. He took all the influences of my favorite guitar players and put them through every solo, through every song. It was a no-brainer that I kept Alessandro on bass and keyboards. And, and of course, he mixed the album, he mastered the album. I truly know that this guy's gonna leave a huge mark in music. If I walk away from this 